this game is actually known as popularly the first postmodern game, and that was Metal Gear Solid 2. Again, it's lauded as the first postmodern game, and for good reason. I mean, this game came out in 2001, 20 years ago. This game predicted fake news, the aperspectival madness to come out of the internet. There are really weird gameplay mechanics where the main player in the game, Raiden, is actually a projection of the player himself. And the game actually breaks down the fourth wall, which is a very postmodern storytelling device. There's one point in the game where it actually tells you to turn off your console while you're playing and then to turn it back on in order to get to the next section of the game. So it's it's another part later in the game where it glitches out. You're in the middle of of a fight and it makes you think it's a video game glitch. So it's it's got all of these really, wow. really postmodern oh, yeah. devices to it. Wow. Uh, green across the board, green gameplay, green yeah. content, green theme. 